languages. I want to encourage you to learn as many languages as possible. Why? Because communication is design. Now, when I talk about languages, I don't mean um, languages, actual languages. I do recommend to learn as many languages as possible. I myself speak only four languages fluently. I can curse in like three or four more, and I know a couple of words in a couple more. The more languages that you know, actual languages, you will be able to communicate with different people, you will be able to understand different cultures, etc., etc. But I'm talking about languages as general ideas, as concept. Design is a language, and design has a lot of languages inside it. Even just visual design, graphic design. It has at least five or six different languages, and I'm talking about languages that have their own rules, that have their own syntax, that have their own grammar, that have their own inbuilt meanings. Languages that you can use in different kinds of projects, for different kinds of clients, for different kinds of products, to communicate different kinds of things. If you talk to children, in a visual design project for schools or education or playtime, it is not the same language that you would use for a high-tech company that needs their professional internet site or application or any material that they use for conferences and things like that. When you're trying to sell something, you will need to use a certain kind of language when you're trying to convey an idea or a concept that is more spiritual, more open, you will need to use another kind of language. Now, I'm not talking about saying different things in the same language. I'm actually talking about different languages, using different words, using different colors, using different forms, using different layouts. For me, these are all completely different languages. The more languages that you know, the more languages that you can speak, the more you can give your clients what they need. And this is the most important thing in any design career. Again, I will say it over and over again. The difference between art and design is that in design career, you work for others. You're not working for yourself. You're not creating for yourself. You have a client, and this client has needs, and your job is one to supply this client a solution for his needs. That is all. It could be a beautiful solution, it could be an interesting solution, it could be an innovative, brilliant, amazing solution, but it is, still has to be a solution because this is the client and he pays. And you need the money to pay your rent. You are working as a designer to create a solution. The more languages you know, 